Okay, here's another foot. Uh, cadaver foot. Now I want you to see here. Let's see. Let me zoom it in. How the lamina. Let me get a pointer. The lamina only go to right here. That is these little lines you see here. But right here, from here down, it looks fuzzy. Well, that's because it's the same thing. This is on the bottom of the foot right here, of the sole. The papillae from which the sole grows, goes and lips right over the edge of that there. Here. Let me get this up. Again, it doesn't, uh, let's see. It doesn't just, uh, let's go over here. It doesn't just grow to here, down like so. Okay? This, from which the soul grows, is slightly lipped up over the coffin bone. Like, eh, not a very good line. Like so. That's, so your soul actually, of course, starts growing. Well, it, the wall comes down, joins up with the soul here, and then they grow down together. Like so. Okay, now because this here is shaped like this, see that? The soul growing down like that. When it gets down here, it's also supposed to have a ridge like so. That's why a lot of times you'll see that little, that bump there. Oh, sorry. It grows down and looks like that. Here, let me back up. Okay, again, the sole does not grow straight from just right the very tip bottom of the foot, the internal foot, because the sole corium slightly lips up over the edge of the coffin bone here. So the sole joins with the hoof right about in here, and it continues down, and the shape it has when it gets down here is not concave, but it's convex. But then, as it comes under the foot, see how the foot then right here at the very base, right when you get here, the foot starts to go up like that. From here, it gets concave. Okay? But going up over the lip, it's convex. So the sole is crescentric, meaning it takes uh, the qualities of both being convex and concave. It's convex at the toe, like so, and then it goes up and under and joins with the frog like that. And so this ridge of sole here, that, that I drew that, no, oh, sorry about that. Okay, so it's concave here, coming around the toe, and, or, no, it's convex here, coming around the toe, and then as it goes under the foot, it turns concave. And so you should have a ridge of sole under the toe of the coffin bone that is convex. But then as it moves towards the frog, it becomes concave. I don't know why I drew the wall so long here.